Hello friends, welcome to Technique. This is Normal here. And in this video, we're going to do a speed test comparison of two smartphones, the Realme X7 Pro versus the Realme X7. So these two devices have the new 5G enabled uh, chipsets from MediaTek. We have the Dimensity uh, 1000 plus octa core processor on the Realme X7 Pro, while we have the Realme uh, X7 coming with the Dimensity 800U chipset. Now both are really powerful chipsets and both are 5G enabled. Now the Realme uh, X7 is priced almost 20,000 but uh, the Realme uh, X7 Pro is priced, priced closer to 30,000 rupees. So how much is the difference between the uh, MediaTek Dimensity 800U versus the 1000 plus? That's what we are going to do in this video. So we'll be doing a simple speed test uh, to see if there is any real world uh, performance improvement if you go with uh, the 1000 plus of course the 1000 plus is more powerful and suited for better gaming experience that's there but in uh, in terms of real time usage uh, opening of apps uh, the regular apps like social apps uh, camera settings and all those things included is there a major difference between these two devices that's what we're going to talk about in this video so this will be a speed test comparison of the realme x7 pro with the realme x7 so before going to the speed test, if this is your first time on this channel, do hit that subscribe button and also hit the bell icon to get notified of all the videos we publish. So let's get started with the speed test comparison of the Realme X7 Pro with the Realme X7. So we have the two Realme X7 series, so the Realme X7 Pro and the Realme X7. So let's just go to the settings and uh, let's see uh, the details here about phone and uh, here also you can see about phone so realme x7 pro 5g realme x7 5g uh, the dimensity 800u octa core processor while we have the dimensity 1000 plus octa core processor both have 8 gigabyte ram both are running on android 10 and both have the realme ui 1.0 so that's the difference uh, here so only the difference uh, here is the the processor the dimensity 1000 plus versus the dimensity 800u so that's the only difference so we're going to do a speed test comparison here to see how different uh, these two uh, processors are so we just cleared off all the apps in the background so there you go uh, everything is cleared off now let's uh, see uh, the network also so you can see here both are connected to the same wi-fi network both have to uh, we have turned on turned off the bluetooth on both the devices both are in airplane mode so similar state uh, on both the devices now next uh, once again we'll just clear off uh, you can see here nothing is running in the background so let's start the speed test so first step would be asphalt 9 so let's see how different these two devices are now both have the gaming mode enabled so you can see that uh, the uh, the realme x7 pro has taken the lead here let's see uh, which is able to open uh, the game faster So you can see that uh, this is quite obvious because uh, there is a lot of difference here. So you can see that uh, the X7 Pro uh, has opened the game faster. Now next is uh, Temple Run. So here again you can see that uh, uh, the Realme X7 Pro is faster. Play Store. Again X7 Pro. So here again you can see that X7 Pro is uh, faster, in fact uh, there was an error but still it was faster on the X7 Pro. Facebook, here you could see that X7 was slightly faster. Twitter, again X7 uh, Pro was faster. Here also X7 Pro was faster. Ghana, here you could see that uh, X7 is faster here uh, in terms of opening of uh, the app. Next is uh, Amazon, uh, probably same uh, but then X7 Pro had a, a minor edge, Flipkart, again X7 Pro was faster, File Manager, X7 is faster, again uh, not much of a difference, YouTube, again almost same time, so here X7 Pro was faster, Camera both are quite similar, Maps, 
again quite similar but uh, uh, the x7 pro was faster so what you could see is while uh, there is a much bigger difference in terms of the processing abilities in real world you won't see much of a drastic difference except for heavy tasks like uh, games where you definitely see the difference 800u versus the thousand plus but in day-to-day -day usage in regular apps you won't see much of a difference between the 800u and the thousand plus unless you are doing heavy gaming that will definitely make a difference now next uh, let's see the memory management so it's retained, camera is retained, Gmail is retained, YouTube is retained, settings, file manager, Flipkart, Amazon, Ghana, Ghana is reloaded on both the phones, Instagram again uh, reloaded on both the phones, Twitter, Facebook is available, Chrome is available. Play Store is available. Again, uh, this is reloaded. The games are reloaded. We have seen this uh, uh, on uh, the other devices. When, you, when we compared with other devices as well, the AT and uh, the Nord, uh, the games are reloaded. Again, uh, you can see that this is also reloaded. So what you could see is that the 800U is, uh, I mean, rather the 1000 plus is obviously more powerful than the 800U. Uh, in terms of uh, overall abilities but in real world you may not see that kind of drastic difference because the price difference is uh, a lot almost close to 10,000 rupees the difference is there but in terms of actual uh, performance it will actually show up only in heavy or other intensive task like gaming otherwise it's kind of uh, more or less uh, slightly different uh, in terms of experience but not a drastic difference so that's the sweetest comparison of the Realme X7 Pro with the Realme X7. Hope you enjoyed watching this video. Do hit that like button and also hit the red subscribe button for more videos. Thanks for watching. Hope to see you in our next video. Have a great day.